After what feels like forever, Chung Se Woon is back. Let's check out what he has today on the culture study. Hey groupies, welcome back to Former Therapy. I am the video channel producer. You can call me PD and this is The Culture Study. Today we are going to be checking out the music video Feeling by Chong se -un, featuring Panamiko. Chong se -un had a phenomenal debut with Just You, then Baby It's You, and then he sort of did like side projects here and there, did the project that involved like the MXM artists and etc. But this is his comeback. So I'm excited to check it out. I really like Chong se -un's stuff. I like him as a singer. I'm curious as to what he's going to bring for us musically this time. But before we get into this video, I just want to say if you like what we do on this channel, if you want to support us, if you want to see some more original content from us, uh, consider supporting us at patreon.com slash form of therapy for as little as $2 a month. You get early access to videos like this and more coming in the future. But that's completely voluntary. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. Just join me as we check out this video here. Let's get into it. This is your form of therapy. Yet another title track that has a very heavy acoustic guitar presence. The melody isn't the same, but you know, reminiscent of Baby uh, It's You. Or Just You, sorry. I love the way this is shot. Feels very much like old, old school film. We'll talk about it later. Ooh, great color tone. Wow, I'm singing in like a really, really high register. Ooh, interesting. It's like that kind of quote unquote instrumental uh, EDM drop that you get in other songs, but it's a mix of like the electronic production, but also the acoustic guitar. I just love that the percussion is keeping this song so alive. Like the rhythm is like, it never lets up. And it feels like the texture is just like traveling like all throughout my senses. Wow, Panamiko was in this music video a lot. They incorporated uh, him in a lot. Oh, Phenomico with like the underlayered like uh, uh, ad libs. I really like that. Ooh, that's cool. Matisse. Oh, what a gorgeous set. Very interesting. Okay. Alright, 
Very fun song. I am not disappointed by Chung Soon. I definitely like it more than Baby It's You. Baby It's You was a little bit too electronic for my taste, a little bit too artificial in the production. I like this because it's a little bit more along the lines with Just You. It does a great job of combining sort of like the artificial electronic sounds with this acoustic guitar. And the acoustic guitar here is definitely like way more prevalent than Just You actually was. I feel like the song, it has a great rhythm to it, it's very, very bouncy. The entire song, the percussion throughout the song makes it feel like it's like traveling throughout my ears. I really like that. Overall, it's just got a great, great, lively energy to it. I thought Panamico, he had a really long rap feature. It was really good, but also like him being mixed into the video was actually really well done. I think the music video director did a good job of that. It doesn't feel like they just threw him in last minute, which sometimes these rap features do feel like. Even the sick case feature on Chung Soo Just You, that was sort of like the bare minimal, you know, they made it look visually very good, but it definitely felt more like an added on feature as opposed to being mixed in really seamlessly. And this one feels a lot more seamless. I want to check out this music video again, but because there were a few things that actually caught my eye that I want to share with you guys. All right, so as I was pointing out earlier, this is shot a little bit like old school film. And one of the things is this part right here and the scenes that you see throughout the music video, this is supposed to emulate the actual film strip. Film strip is basically, it's a series of images taken on a series of long films. So it's like, imagine it's like photography. It's a bunch of images being taken. And then when you play it at a fast enough speed, it plays like a movie, like a video. And so right here, this is supposed to emulate the film aspect of it. That's why there's a square here, but there's a square above and below as well. One of the big takeaways is the rounded edges that you see on the video right here. The rounded edges is definitely what makes it look like a film strip. What's pretty cool is you can actually see a little bit of the feathering, like it's actually dark in the corners. So the corners are darkened in some of the old film shots. That's pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> And like the way he like hits like some of the actual guitar strings, it's like done, done. It's so it, it's so violently striking. If you actually go back a little bit before, there's a lot of like these particles falling, like it looks like flower petals. I don't know what exact, uh, exactly the material is, but it creates this very romantic mood that they're setting in this video. <laughs> That's a cool setup. Look at how they sequined those shots together. That's so cool.
This shot right here, I was waiting for this shot. This shot, it actually kind of emphasizes this style that Chong Zewoon has. Right here, you see like the spotlight, but in general, you see the style of the mic that he actually has. It's actually sort of like an old school retro microphone, sort of like a radio host type of mic, but also used generally back in like, there's somewhere in like the 30s and 50s, somewhere in that era, those mics were very prevalent. And he has like an old dick clark sort of johnny carson type of vibe he has such excellent showmanship you know i think that's one of the things about chung zoo that actually really stands out he has excellent showmanship and he's dressed always really sharp he's more mature for his age like he's more mature than he looks type of vibe that he's going for you know i mean a lot of the songs that he sings are very romantic but it also comes from like a very warm and comforting place so i feel like he has a very cool vibe for that so that kind of triggered that you know i think he just has a very classic hollywood sort of stardom to him i think he has a very bright future <laughs> This shot is actually really interesting. So throughout the entire music video, the set that you generally see him in is against the wall. And then there's the shadow of the curtains, all right? And then there's the window to his left and our right. And the light is coming in and that's how it lights him. This shot in particular, this is the only quote unquote outside shot. So this shot in theory is the shot looking into, into the position he's in in the music video but he's directly looking at you. So this is the outside window perspective of the main set, but the entire set is mainly indoors of this quote unquote set up living room or bedroom or whatever he's in. So occasionally it cuts away to these outside window shots and it has a voyeuristic aspect sort of looking in. <laughs> And look at that overhead light casting like this glow on him. It just looks so epic. Dope. Like I said, dope comeback. Great song. Very cool music video. Honestly, like nothing but praise on my end. I'm really curious. There was rumors that Chung Soo-hoon would be debuting into a boy group, but I think that was just the project thing that he did, the other MXM members. But honestly, I really like him as a solo artist. I think he puts out really good music. You guys, thanks for watching this episode of The Culture Study. Let me know what you thought about the music video and the song in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this and you would like to support us, consider visiting us at patreon.com slash formatherapy. For as little as $2 a month, you get early access to to videos like this and more and for higher tiers you get live stage reactions dance practices and etc however you don't have to support us monetarily that is completely optional why don't you go ahead and consider just clicking like down below right there go ahead and leave a comment it helps us out with youtube search algorithm and if you're new go ahead and click subscribe be notified when we upload a new video by hitting that notification bell and check out our other reactions over here